I remember, I gotta tell the whole story, how they got there. Before they got, they went and get the keys, they come down, they say, somebody tried to get into my unit, there's scratches on my door, say, and like, oh, um, um, I'm really sorry, but who will think it's gonna get into your unit because it's saw some scratches on the door, like, what, four inches above the door? Because the dog was crashing, the door was trying to get in, and they thought about someone trying to break into the, the, the unit. I said, on my head, I was like, you really, you think someone's trying to get into your unit? There's crashes like four inches above your the floor and your door. That was the dog trying to get into the unit. They were so afraid. Oh, someone's trying to get into my unit. They're like, oh, come on, really? And I actually went. They asked me to go inside the unit just to check room by room to make sure that no one was there. So I did that as part of my job, make sure they're safe. But I like really, I didn't understand why they want me to do that. Like, oh, I don't know. <laughs> I just so stressed out because of this. I just don't want to deal with this anymore. I'm tired. I don't want to deal with this court case. I, everybody got problems, and I don't want to deal with this no more. I don't want. I don't want to put this in any more words. The interaction you just testified about is Amber Heard and Rocky Pennington, and talking about the dog and going up and checking out the penthouse. None of that was on video footage, correct? That's correct. That we don't have cameras in the videos. I'm mean, sorry, we don't have cameras at the hallway. We okay. don't have cameras on the hallway. I'm gonna show you